Right, check this out. Very special 60 series right here. Um, 10th month, 1986, SS 150. Now, um, it's part of the SS 60 edition, so the special series 60. Uh, these were produced, um, there was 50. So this is number 41 out of 50. These are produced for the South Australian Jubilee. So 150 years of European settlement down there in South Australia. Um, and Toyota come up with these and they're beautiful. They're all silver. They all come with like different variations of the decals. Um, and come with about all the bells and whistles that they came with at the time. So uh, just we'll, we'll start up the front with this vehicle. We'll go inside later and show what's going on in there. It's, it's mad. So um, Tristan that owns this vehicle has done loads to it since he's had it. Tristan's owned it since um, 2015. And since then he's kitted this thing out. It is his touring rig. Uh, they go away camping as much as possible in this thing. So um, and, and what a rig to do it in as well. But up the front we've got the ARB ball bar. ARB scrub rails, we've got the steady headlight up upgrades in there, the UHF aerial AM FM upgrade, um, safari snorkel, a must really when you do the touring that this guy does, um, swags ready to go with the roof rack, max tracks over there as well. We've got the gold wing rear windows, now these are cool man, very good for accessing your stuff in the side there. Side steps, rock sliders are a must, but going underneath, this thing's got some kit man. So the diffs have been upgraded to the, uh, the 4.56 ratio, 4 ratio diff, um, crown wheel and pinion. It's twin locked this thing, um, four speed auto, and the powerhouse under the bonnet, not many of them came with this, but the 12 HT, the mighty 12 HT under there. Um, and it's just been to our good mate, Harley Klein, down at Whistle and Sir, he's just done some R&D on this, and he's come up with um, the future Whistle and Sir, um, 2H turbo, 12HT, three inch, three and a half inch um, exhaust for this thing. It's absolutely awesome what he's done here, man. Um, it sounds awesome. We'll have a little bit of a listen to that in a minute. So yeah, whistle and soot, an awesome upgrade for this vehicle. Just finishes it off real nice. We'll have a quick look under the bonnet because there's some stuff going on under there. Definitely one you to have a look at. The mighty 12HT, just check it out. So. Um, it's pretty stocko. Um, here in Mr. Land Cruiser, we've done a few things maintenance-wise. So we've done got the 80 Series Booster over there and the 80 Series Master. Um, and we've got a brand new alternator with a brand new vacuum pump as well. So the brakes are working absolutely perfect now. We had um, a rear seal gone in the rear, which was throwing gear oil all over the brakes. So they contaminated the brake shoes. So all that's been um, got rid of and replaced. Um, in here, you can see we've got the whistle and soot manifold there and then you can see that the, the uh, stainless steel downpipes going on with the v-bands we have a closer look at that that is absolutely awesome it goes all the way through this one's a straight through system um, harley does awesome work his welds are absolutely amazing um, he's custom built these for the, these are going to be off the shelf for mr land cruiser or whistle and soot um, from now on and they're, they're absolutely beautiful bit of kit for your 60 series, that's for sure. We've got dual batteries in here, a must have for a touring rig, nice and simple. You've got the ARB compressor, just sit tucked away in here. Get some diff breathers, stuff like that. Other than that, there's not a lot going on. I will say one thing, Tristan has, he's, he, he's into his 60s, right? So he's got a few of them. He's got a later auto as well, and he's nicked the, the, um, the auto transmission coolers out of the, the square head like one, which doesn't quite fit. He's made it work by cutting out a few bits there, just to keep that auto gearbox nice and cool. Um, uh, definitely an awesome upgrade there. So just check it out in here. This is really where the, uh, the SS150 or the SS60 comes alive. So this was the VX um, Sahara interior, basically. So you've got turbo seats, you've got the, the suede velour, all the bells and whistles from the time. So you've got electric windows, electric door locks. Your thing's even got electric mirrors, that is mad. So you've got normal stuff like you know, inclometer up here, gray dash. Um, not a lot of them came with the, the 12 HT, so it's nice to see one, but definitely set up for touring. We've got the HEMA sits up here. I see two gauges going on, boost, EGTs, very important to know what's going on there. Auto, GME radio, but really, under these RM Williams seat covers, I can just imagine that these seats are perfect, because in the back here, they're absolutely immaculate. The roof lining's perfect. 
it's just a pleasure to see something this special and being looked after by Tristan. He's doing a, a really, really fantastic job. Just awesome. I'm so glad we got to show this SS150 off. It's a bit of a special vehicle. There's not many of them out there, especially being number 41 out of 50 ever made. Um, it's really good to see, especially here at Mr. Land Cruiser. Before we go, it'd be rude not to show off the sound of this awesome whistle and soot um, exhaust pipe. It really does sound great with that 12 HT in front of it. Such an awesome sound. So, look, Tristan's getting on the road tonight, off to Cairns. He's giving it a shakedown at Early Beach uh, this weekend, and then the end of August, he's off to the Cape. So, um, very jealous, man. What a vehicle to do it in. Check it out, SS150.